right so cool i'm not really in a reactions but gta 6 is the exception i have to make they've just released the trailer and they've released it a day early simply because somebody leaked it and it's so sad that rockstar has to go through so many leaks it's actually so upsetting for them like i'd hate to be a rockstar developer and every single time somebody's leaking the game like honestly but i just watched the trailer and i have to say this game is going to be game of the decade but it's not something that is a shock to anybody i'm sure everybody already knew that was going to be the case but we have the trailer here i can't really show it because the video will get claimed but like going through it it was easily the best trailer i've ever watched in my life there were just so many moments that were just like wow and i think what i would just do for this video since i can't really show i would like pause at moments like i can like skim through it i think that's the best thing i can do to really give you a show of um <laughs> how great this game is so um let me let me just make this bigger you know i'm gonna do this fully raw because you know what the hell um i'm actually so shocked like just look at the visual just look at the visual it looks amazing off rip right if i just skim through you can see they finally got they finally got people of hair's color which is i mean people of color's hair oh my god i'm losing my words um going further through the 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 scenery looks amazing just look all over they've got so many different cultures within vice city look at the streets the strip they've even got like what i've noticed which is like a big part in, in my opinion i feel like they're very inclusive of a different type of builds so usually when you play games with a create a character mode you won't necessarily be able to change how your character looks to the minute details so things like your facial structure they already had that in gta 5 but i feel like they've gone even a step further with gta 6 which is wild um a lot more hair customizations which is great overall everybody's looking for that it gives you more time like to spend on minute details something i saw which was insane They've got Instagram on the game, like literally Instagram, but we'll get to that. Look, you can see here it's like follow dad bod squad. I don't know if that's going to be part of the story or it's a feature that you'd actually be able to have in game. So uh, that's also dope, dope as hell. Um, if we keep going forward, more of the Instagram, which is why I specifically said Instagram. There's the lights going up. There's a comment section. Finna spin the block with this one. Look at the your girl. I think that's what it says uh one 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 nine nine i don't even it doesn't even matter but it's the fact that this is this is so detailed you can imagine the game's gonna go insane there's also like crocodiles i think gta 5 already had animals but, but like this just being a part of the story is pretty cool as well and it's also on like through like social media so i think they might be bringing back like the uh G rockstar games have that like i fruit thing and it's like the social media which was actually very very good i enjoyed that a lot so many other like features and it's a lot of it's being shown through like like instagram let's i'm just gonna say i'm just gonna call it instagram uh, they've got like this section here where you can see like the the mud in the area is having an impact on how the characters look so obviously they've been hit with a lot of mud and whatnot uh the driving here the mc lucia like she's beautiful by the way but like it was just pretty cool uh having her as like part of this trailer i'm actually just lost for words i'm trying to find so many different parts in this trailer i could do a full breakdown but this is purely a reaction like, look at this they got damn florida jits really going crazy they got the jewelry and he's got multiple layers so you probably like in gta um 5 you can have jewelry of course but you can't layer multiple on me I'm, I'm assuming you can layer them he's got two bits of jewelry he's even got rings uh the glasses of course they got the grills in the mouth more customization the lock's going crazy i'm trying to get mine i'm trying to get me right mine are not going to look like those but i'm trying to get myself right too they're just ah this is insane this is insane the strip club they got girls twerking bro i think a lot of people are going to be seeing the strip club i'm trying to find where it is without playing it but they had girls twerking in the strip club i'm literally just excited like i'm super excited in general having girls twerking in the strip club is crazy i think that's crazy people are going to be in the strip club all day just you know what i'm saying like <laughs> they're not leaving the strip club guys are going to be there all day all day they're not leaving the strip club right right look i think it's this segment here look this girl here she had motion she had motion bruh strip club's gonna go crazy that's not even me being down bad but people are already visiting the strip club in gta 5 and the gta 5 strip club already has nothing it can't even compare to this one the gta 6 strip club going crazy already look how many people are filling up the place where does it say make it rain mondays it's a monday and it's lit like this it's lit like this on a monday 
Nah, that is nuts, man. They got little car meets. Already had that in GTA 5 as well, but like everything's so much more high scale is what's to be pointed out. I think that's the big thing everybody should take in. Everything's so much more high scale. But then of course, the sad part for a lot of people coming in 2025. 2025, we're at the end of 2023. So we have to wait the whole 2024. Me personally, I don't care how long it takes because I really like that the developers take time to develop their game. And in general, a lot of workers be overworked. But I think what's the bigger issue is that a lot of people would get... um. What you call it? A lot of things will get leaked, sorry. But what I will say is, with coming of GTA 6, in general, GTA 5 had a lot of bugs when it first came out. It was overloaded. They didn't release online for the first week, if I remember correctly. So if they're going to drop GTA 6, right, I just hope that they drop it with the most like smooth running game as they can get possible. Because there is going to be some bugs. With the how big and how much there is in this world, like... It's nuts. You're going to have bugs. There's going to be bugs without a doubt. So really and truly, I just hope that they're able to drop it with as minimal bugs as possible. The cars look beautiful, by the way. I'd even touch on those. Look at this. This is like a, I think that's like a Porsche. Got, got the Lamborghinis. It's beautiful cars all over the place. Different types of outfits. It looks like, what's the game? It's like the GTA RP. That's how good this is in general. But yeah, I we will we will be playing. We will be playing. I will be there. I'm sure you guys will be there too. I'm I'm just gassed. So I had to do a quick upload with this man, without a doubt. But yeah, man, I'm gonna leave it like that. I don't have any more words. I could talk for I could talk about GTA forever. But I'm intrigued to see. I don't know his name, but they did talk about Lucia, and a lot of people. <laughs> A lot of people weren't necessarily happy that the MC is a woman, but that's such a dumb reason to not be happy, bro. Just be happy with the fact that they're putting so much effort in. And it's not just Lucy, obviously. I, I believe there's two with all the leaks that have come out so far. But yeah, we will be there 2025. Rockstar, thank you for producing this masterpiece, man. Take care, everybody, man. This is crazy.